horizontal video? I think so. Alright, this is a different video. Using an avocado as a tripod. Maybe a sweet potato. I've got the same sweater on, but it is a different day. I'll take this off. Actually, I'll just take, take my shirt off. Hey! Today is a day. It has started interestingly. Not the most positive. Uh, but only if I look at it negatively. It's actually been pretty damn awesome. So, let me just change that right away. So, oh, I got good response from my last video. I like the comments. I like that people want to see more videos, so I'm going to try to do some more videos. Um, I don't know how well they're going to be done, but I'll do them. Um, right now, just kind of having an interesting day. Had to get up and uh, go to court this morning. Dealing with some heavy stuff, but it's all good. I've learned a lot about myself and how I want to be, what I want to be. Something interesting in this egg, but. I think it's just the embryo. It's like appetizing. There's a yolk in my hand. Ah. Um. Yeah, I don't really know what to say. I mean, I'm just trying to be as positive as I can be, as real as I can be. Um, yeah. Ended a 60 day colon cleanse. I was dealing with some issues with anger, and uh, my mentor, Paul Check, told me that it could be coming from a backed up liver. I had been drinking alcohol regularly and not eating the most perfect diet or really exercising super regularly, whatever, I don't know, I'm, I eat good, I work out. I was upset because I was in a relationship that I probably shouldn't have been in, but that I really tried to want, but ultimately didn't. And I think that happened like on both parties, so... Yeah, I mean, I'm trying to kind of make sense of it all, but it's all good. I just want to make sure everyone knows that I love them. And I just really hope that everyone is, is all right. For sure. Alcohol will tear you up. Um, yeah, so, I'm not like super hungry or anything, I'm gonna go to the bars, I've been going, riding my bicycle to the bars every Wednesday and doing some, some calisthenics on the pull-up bars by the river, it's a good little spot, get some sun, some nature, it's kinda, it's in the city, I'm addicted to the city, I love the city, I like just cruising in the city, people watching, looking at all the man-made fun. But I love the the nature too. I'll, I'll go outside and go camping. I'm sure tomorrow or something. Whatever. Go jump in a cold river. Um. So yeah, I'm kind of just putting some food in me. 
whatever I have here at the house. I might make some juice or something. I've been doing a green juice that is uh, just cucumber, celery, and parsley or cilantro. Super good. Um, been rock climbing a lot. Just in the gym. Not outside, just bouldering. Been using the uh, gym's facilities. <sighs> yeah, so basically, I wanna make this video just because I wanna keep putting out content, just regular updates, maybe weekly, maybe monthly, maybe yearly. Who knows? But, um... I'm gonna go about my day and just continue to stay positive, go through my routines like usual, take care of my body, take care of my mind, listen to some positive audio, which I've already done some today, and, you know, get some exercise, and smile, and be grateful, and be happy, because I have nothing to worry about. Everything's going to be okay. It really is. And, um... going to have fun. Really enjoy those eggs. They're really, really delicious. Um... What else can we do? What else can we eat? Oh, let's see what's in the fridge. Got some awesome kombucha from the farmer's market. Some... Kraut, some blueberries. What do I want? I think I would just want a little sip of this kombucha. Uh, maybe some raw milk. Fuck it. Get some more protein and fat. And these blueberries? These strawberries getting moldy? Uh, I'm so like... Just... Chilling today. Straight chilling. It's like my, you know, my fr I work four days on, ten hour shifts, and then I get three days off. And uh, first day, I'm off. It's always super, just chill, lazed out. Like sometimes I have things to do. Like today, I had to go to court. I don't know what else I have to do. Hmm. <laughs> Blueberries are good. I like just riding my bicycle around. I really like hiking and camping, but I'm not like super self-motivated to do it. I kind of like kind of like doing it with other people, or with at least someone. I really enjoyed doing that with Kaylin, my ex-girlfriend, but we're not able to do that right now. She doesn't want to want to speak to me right now. I'm respecting that. I don't know why. I think probably just because she doesn't like me right now, but that's right. I'm just going to focus on the future. I got goals. I got dreams. I got more stuff to do. More places to go. More people to meet. More enjoyment to be had. More wisdom. More life. No, it's just me eating blueberries. Hmm. Tempted to eat this avocado. Yeah, actually, I am gonna eat it. This is a strawberry kombucha that the guy made. Uh, it tastes kind of alcoholic. I'm uh, doing a quick little five day liver cleanse, slamming a bunch of these pills every day, dandelion and milk thistle and some other things. Like I said, I'm trying to get rid of that anger, trying to, I've just been forcing myself with positive affirmations.
whether or not it works for people who are in a, a certain situation already or not. I mean, it is what it is. I'm not going to talk too much about it. The, the moment, like I said, was the important part. And the fact that you have a definite purpose and you want to go somewhere. And you want to take people there with you, you know, or share with people where you went. That's the point. It's just, that's what drives things to happen, is just having desires at all. It doesn't matter what they are. No one's to judge, but judgment brings awareness. And awareness creates, you know, it, uh, awareness creates the opportunity for change. Awareness is consciousness, so judgment brings consciousness. Uh, the dual, the dual nature uh, of reality ha has to be there. The laws are there, and they all work together. You just have to understand them, and then once you can understand them, you can play with the laws a little bit. It's kind of like the, the judicial system. You got like all this, all these different plays. It's like a playbook. All these different scenarios that can that can go down in order for there to be a success. And success is when things are happening without anyone being really hurt. You know what I mean? That's my goal is just to be successful. I want to be taken care of while I take care of people. I, you know, that's what I'm going to do today and probably a lot more frequently is um, some charity work. Uh, I've been alone a lot lately. It's energizing, but it's interesting because I just end up talking to myself and talking to this phone and just posting these videos on YouTube. And they are ADHD like a motherfucker. Um, you know, I'm talking randomly. It's nonsense, but. Maybe after I listen to it, instead of just talking, I'll learn something. Because I feel like I'll learn when I listen, but not while I'm talking. But yeah. This is just for you guys anyway. Waste your time listening to this. Skip through. Listen to it. Enjoy it. Don't. Whatever. This avocado, I don't know if it's ripe or not. Yeah, not really. Felt like it was. You know what's really good is I usually will uh, spice these up with a bunch of turmeric and cayenne and salt and pepper. Mmm. Really good though. Yeah, I'm kind of deep in my head right now, obviously. I just turned this on just because, like, I'm sitting here in my apartment looking at fucking all my goddamn social media feeds. Over and over in a techno loop, you know? Like I said, I've been by myself a lot lately. No, not a lot of ladies. Not a lot of friends. Just me lately, and it's kind of empowering. It's energizing. It's interesting. Nikola Tesla talks about how, you know, some people gain energy from being with a woman and it's it supports them and uh, or with a partner, I should say. But um, but then but 
but for him it was like the opposite he he got energy from being by himself and I don't know what I necessarily do but I know it's easier for me to stay calm and uh, collected and when I can just be on myself but then I'm really not ever really by myself because I always have those social media apps and or nature, a plant, an animal, a, a thing, a toy, a, a, a food, a, a meditation, a thought. There's always something with me or something that I'm sharing with or sharing to or listening to. So yeah, life is good, I'm happy, I'm healthy, I feel good, physically strong, mentally strong, I feel like I've done a lot of contemplation, and I will continue to do a lot of com contemplation. I just have this burning desire and this really great attitude to, uh, To give constant effort in the form of positive thought and action. So like everything that I do, I want to go the extra mile. And everything that I do, I want to do everything excellently. So that my entire life can be like a living prayer, a living worship to everything else. Because I feel like I owe... I don't owe my life, but I feel like I just really, really love and respect everything on a really deep level, and uh, it's hard to talk about, but it's a cool place to to go and to, to get to and to realize and kind of hang out in. You can't really take a lot of people there with you. You just got to be there in it by yourself while you realize all those other people are in there with you anyway and not judging them for being how they are and the, your whole cosmic experience is awesome I don't know I don't know these are just random thoughts I'm just randomly talking it's almost like a video journal sometimes I go back and listen sometimes not obviously some people listen and maybe get some things out of it if there was anything I wanted anyone to get out of anything right now it would be brotherly love and everything associated with it open-mindedness, one love, the whole focus on yourself and your dreams, and not what you don't have, but what you do have and what you can have. Force yourself to be positive. Choose. Use your mind. Use everything. Go hard. Max out. Fucking be passionate. Love what you're doing. Everything that you're doing and everyone that you're doing it with. And really get really deeply physically involved and emotionally involved in whatever you do. This is 
is almost like a, a meditation. A filmed eating meditation. How many minutes do we have? 20 minutes? Jeez Louise. 20 minutes. Felt like two minutes. Have I even said anything? Have I done anything remotely entertaining? Uh, let's see. What do you want from me? Handstand skills. I'm gonna show off. Mm. Handstand skills. Oh. 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 Life is about having fun, or whatever you want it to be about. My life is about having fun. <sighs> My life is good. My life is love. My life is happening right now. This is it. And I'm singing about it. I'm living in an apartment. I ain't got no roommates for the very first time. Uh, life is new. This is one of my plants. This is another one. That's rosemary. That's like a spider plant or something. This is my little altar. My little rock hangout collection. Some more art from Lou. Some presents. Some dab rig action. You got his dab. This is Dab City. In my living room. Oh, how many minutes are we gonna go? 23 minutes? That's probably plenty. Hey! Well, you can do it. Whatever you want. Whatever your mind can. something, then it'll do something. <laughs> achieve it. You'll perceive it, then believe it. Believe it, perceive it, achieve it. Believe it, perceive it. Achieve it, perceive it, believe it. <clears throat> the mind is everything. Everything is the mind. That word mind means everything. The mind and God are kind of the same concept. The concept of God comes out of the mind. The mind is a network of all things, all consciousness, all intelligence, including the intelligence in the chair, in the dab rig, in the countertop, in the human being, in the rock, in the earth, in the orbits, in the gravity. Everything is the mind. You have control over your perception of the mind. The mind can conceals or holds all that is. When you change your perception in the mind, on the mind, then you change your viewpoint. You change your experiences. You change your whole sense perceptions but the mind still holds everything it's just you control it's like the channel changer your thoughts and your your attention your consciousness your consciousness like the individual is just like a channel changer through the the infinite set that is everything the mind so the mind and your mind are diff it, but not really mind is but when we talk you and I and we separate it that just means that the perception of realities and there's infinite realities and infinite perceptions so have fun with it make it what you want um, 
and uh, and yeah, have fun, enjoy, keep searching, keep reading, keep watching, keep listening, keep laughing, keep meditating, keep loving, keep fucking, keep smoking weed, keep drinking beers, keep uh, eating avocados, keep being vegan or primal or paleo or being moms or dads or brothers or uncles or judges or criminals or whatever. Just keep going because life is awesome and thanks for doing all of that.